here with men's golf coach Greg Moore. Coach, very good showing last weekend at the Midwest Regional, hosted by Benedictine. Talk a little bit about the performance of your guys. First round was probably what you would term okay, but really came back and played much better in the second day. Yeah, and, and I think it, uh, it, it was a tough course, um, one that required a little bit of finesse work. Um, and, and you could really tell the ones that were able to adjust quickly and the ones that kind of took a little bit of time. Um, you know, it, it would, a, a bunch of very solid scores um, managed to get us an eighth place finish, which was our highest of the year so far, which is great um, out of 33 teams. Um, and overall, a really nice weekend turning around. Talk a little bit individually. Um, we haven't been able to say Brett Jackson's name too often. He was hurt early in the year. Played very well, finished eighth individually, 75-74. Uh, talk a little bit about what he brings to this team. You know, uh, Brett just brings a whole lot of consistency. You, know, you always know what you're going to expect out of him. He, he's never a guy to go super, super low, but he's a guy that can manage to get you uh, a, an even round, 72, and, and, and give you some consistency throughout both rounds. Um, you know, he's kind of been kind of our unofficial team leader. The guy, He's a guy that everyone goes to when they need – leadership or someone to, to just give him a little bit of stability so I mean he's definitely a very solid part of our team and, and we're, we're really glad to have him back 100% uh, healthy. And you're speaking of consistency you certainly got to throw Blair Sanders into that mix because uh, he's been Mr. Consistent all year with rounds every round has been in the 70s. Uh, talk a little bit of freshman wise uh, really kind of stepping into his own uh, at the collegiate level. Yeah very much very much I mean we've uh, he's been a very welcome addition to our team um, you know, coming in, I wasn't really sure what to expect. I mean, it, sometimes it takes first years to a little bit of time to adjust to the college game, and especially a guy like Blair who spent kind of the, the better half of the past three years outside of competitive golf. So um, wasn't really sure how he was going to adjust, but he has adjusted very well, um, you know, giving us some very solid scores coming through in the clutch, uh, especially in the middle of our, of, of our li lineup. Talk a little bit this weekend. It's really kind of the final tune-up before the conference championships. You head to Wisconsin Lutheran. An oddity in that it's a Sunday-Monday tournament rather than the usual Saturday-Sunday. But talk a little bit about what you want to see this weekend, especially being it's your last competitive rounds before the conference championships. You know, I, I, and another step forward. You know, We talk about ever since our first weekend in Augsburg that every, every day we just want to take the next step you know, and, and just improve a little bit so that by the time we're heading towards the conference championships up in Bunker Hill um, in a couple weeks – that we're, we're ready to go and we're firing on all cylinders. So I guess the big thing I want to see out of, out of our guys is a little bit uh, more consistency, especially out of the bottom half of the lineup. I want to see some solid scores. I want to see um, some good effort. And I want to see some, some, some mind going through it and some, and some quality golf um, going forward this weekend. So it's going to be a lot of quality opponents and just take the next step. One last tune-up before the conference championships this weekend at Wisconsin Lutheran Invitational. Good luck, Coach. Thanks.